Hi everyone, Connor here from Block Demon, and today I'm going to show you how to get set up with staking your Elrond eGold tokens live on the blockchain. So let's get started. So to begin with staking your Elrond tokens, you first need access to an Elrond wallet that supports staking and also have at least one eGold token, which is the native currency of Elrond in that wallet. This is because one eGold is the minimum staking requirement that you need to begin staking on the Elrond network. So make sure you meet that requirement before stake, starting your staking journey. You'll see that I'm currently set up with an Elrond wallet on the official Elrond wallet homepage, which is wallet.elrond.com, and that my wallet has 1.32 eGold in it, valued at about $240. This makes me eligible to begin staking. To start staking, click on the stake button on the left hand side of the screen. This will bring you to the Elrond staking dashboard, which is an overview of the staking network as a whole, and also a snapshot of your personal staking metrics. From here, click on the blue stake now button in the top right corner of the screen. Next, you'll be given an option to choose a staking provider to stake with. So go ahead and click on the search bar at the top of this pop-up window to search for a staking provider. I'm going to choose Block Demon, so I'm so I'm going to type in Block Demon into the search bar, and you'll see that Block Demon is a verified provider on the network. Next, I'll click on the name to select, then press the continue button. From here, you'll be shown a sliding scale to choose what percentage of your total balance you want to stake with Block Demon. I'm happy to stake 100% of my eGold coins, so I'll go ahead and choose this option. On the next page, you'll be given another chance to confirm the amount you're delegating. If you're happy with everything here, go ahead and press confirm to confirm the staking. The request will take a few moments to process on the network, and very shortly after, you'll get a message that the process was a success. You'll be able to see this transaction in the Elrond Block Explorer, and if you're happy with everything you see, go ahead and click Done. You'll now see that your staking dashboard has been updated to reflect your stake, with Block Demon now listed under your Delegations tab. You can return to this tab at any time to keep track of your claimable eGold rewards. So there you have it. That is how you stake to Block Demon live on the Elrond network. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out to us directly. I hope this helped.